New Life, a testimony by Tez Brooks. Isaiah 58, 8. Then your light will break forth like the dawn, and your healing will quickly appear. Then your righteousness will go before you, and the glory of the Lord will be your rear guard. Our new sapling thrived for a while, with flowers blooming in the spring. But each year the tree waned. Its leaves became sparse, and it stopped blooming. Years of sitting in the wrong spot took its toll. The tree turned into an ugly stick in the ground. That fall, after bending one of the branches, it snapped off in my hand. Sadly, I was about to give up until my fingernails scraped a small amount of bark from the trunk, exposing a moist, green center filled with life. I gently dug up the root ball and relocated the stick next to a sprinkler. Today, that tree is taller than me, blanketed with lush foliage. When I neglect God's word, I'm like that tree, slowly losing ground, producing little to indicate growth. I can appear dead and hopeless. Thankfully, God never gives up. He gently leads me back to his word and takes gentle steps to revive me. Let all creation bless the Lord by Carl P. Daw. Let all creation bless the Lord till heaven with praise is ringing. Sun, moon, and stars peel out a chord, stir up the angels singing. Sing wind and rain, Sing snow and sleet, make music day, night, cold, and heat. Exalt the God who made you. All living things upon this earth, green fertile hills and mountains, sing to the God who gave your birth. Be joyful springs and fountains. Life, water life, bright airborne birds, wild roving beasts, tame flocks and herds, exalt the God who made you.